Hello viewers, uh, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Green Echo Operatives. My name is Katerga, the son of the street vendor. Uh, very passionate about uh, the black soldier fry farming agriculture and preserving the environment. Uh, in today's video, I just want to show you how I have lost all the black soldier fry, all the black soldier fry in my love cage. But guess what? It is not a disaster, but it's just the nature of the black soldier fry. Well, after about one week, they die off. But they die off after laying for you eggs. And I just want to show you now how my BSF looks like after they have died all of them. So this is my love cage, as you see. Everything is empty. Just on where you may see one to three black soldier fry, but uh, this cage was full of black soldier fry. Full. Um, what you see inside are the uh, pupation boxes where uh, I keep the pu pupa in order to merge as house flies, but nothing. So that means um, um, uh, the eggs that I got from the love cage. I have to breed them from here. Then from these eggs, it's where I'll have to rebuild my colon from. I remain with the shelves inside here. Let's check inside. Well, these are the boxes where we have uh, we have been putting the pupa. So these are the shelves as these are the shelves. These are the shells. Hmm. Well, inside there are some some prepupa which are still alive, which are still moving. You can see, but uh, I hope they will pupate. They will pupate very soon. Yes. So you can see most of these things are shells. Most of them are shells from where the, uh, the adult has emerged. So we shall leave this here inside there. Yes. I'm going to invest some love for our client who has some ducks at home. So he wants live love and we are going to invest them. Well, we shall uh, also separate the our prepupa so that we can uh, only sell the uh, the brown larvae. The black ones, as you can see in this video, they are migrating uh, uh, from uh, from their from their bin to a dry cold place where they, we shall collect them and take them to the love cage so as we can uh, keep the colony running 
Therefore, we shall sell only the brown larvae to our client. Yes. So you can see the uh, prepupa is migrating to a dry cool place where we have put the buckets and they are falling inside the bucket. You can see it's most of the black larvae. The black larvae mi migrating away. Yeah. Mm. This is our chicken here, eating some of the fallen uh, larvae. It's enjoying. It's our cock. Uh, so now, this is how our love cage now looks like. Totally, the flies are dead, and we have already. Good, good. Yes. Um, now we have some, uh, we have some waste here. Um, mostly this is a chicken scrap, which I use now. Uh, because for chicken scrap, uh, my neighbors, uh, I have neighbors around and it's easier for me to collect. But for the waste, for the waste, Market waste, it's a bit hard for me due to transportation in, uh, costs. Uh, the, um, the transportation is very difficult for me at the moment. From the work, waste, from the market to the processing center here. So, here our, this is cassava. This was cassava. See, See friends how they have all consumed <laughs> this cassava. that was cassava and uh, so here this bean lacks food actually this is most of this is flask now so I'll have to put more food there uh, let's look into another bucket here wow uh, also this needs a uh, more food this needs more food most of it is now flash they need more food well let's look at this bucket well oh looks like my eggs got dry wow oh as you can see yeah now this is what i want i want also to show you that the eggs got dry if you are observant here so now this can't arch therefore it's very important although i have some some lavies here some young lavies that you can see those which manage to arch let me see inside. Oh, inside I have millions of larvae. Yes, this is good. I have inside millions of larvae. If you are able to see, okay. Yeah. And I hope it's from this, uh, from this bucket here where I'll be able. So I'll try to moisturize some um, the food inside here. Mm. Yes. Good, 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 good. Also, good, good, good. Our progress is not bad. It's good. Now, also, let's check on these ones and see. Wow. They need more food. More food, more food here. More food is needed. More food is needed, and uh, I'll collect the food today. Then we we feed. But let me first harvest. Uh, well, uh, 
Even here, I have some lavy. Here. I have bigger ones, small ones. Now, wow, wow. So today, I'm going to harvest uh, some more larvae. Today, I'm going to harvest more larvae. In the next video, I'm going to show you uh, our biogas digester. Mm -hmm. We are going to rebuild our biogas digester. Uh, it's going to be helping us in uh, drying our larvae and also at the same time cooking. Um, the, once we harvest the larvae, after harvesting the larvae, the frass will be used for uh, biogas purposes. And also the water that uh, we generate from the waste uh we also we hope to use it for to use it in our biodigester uh this is our biodigester which we sh we are going to set up and um actually today i'm from town uh buying these uh valves i found out that these valves are really very helpful in setting up this project here therefore i bought this valve yeah this will help us to turn on and off the gas and also the pipe here this pipe is is going to help us to transport uh our our gas so we shall connect the pipe here here then the gas will be able to come from the pipe and uh, this is how the setup is going to look like we are going to have um, um our our outlet here like this this will be our outlet then we shall connect uh, this here like here then from there we shall have our pipe connected here then this pipe here will come to our collector the biogas collector here where we shall store our gas and be able to use it for drying and cooking our our food this is the uh, inlet which will be used for feeding the waste inside then from here we shall have the outlet of the slurry okay in the next video this is what we are going to this is what i'll be uh, elaborating setting up everything uh, from here thank you so much uh, my name is Katerega please for those of you who have subscribed please thank you so much uh, appreciate we appreciate so much and please uh, like our videos and uh, for those of you who haven't subscribe please subscribe and share thank you so much thank you so much